We've explored several exciting new projects by the U.S. Department of Defense research arm, DARPA, and today we turn our attention to yet another of their ventures. In collaboration with NASA, DARPA has selected Lockheed Martin and BWX Technologies to advance the development of a nuclear-powered spacecraft that could pave the way for future missions to the Moon and Mars. The project, known as the Demonstration Rocket for Agile Cislunar Operations, or DRACO, is poised to provide an in-space test of nuclear thermal propulsion, a potentially revolutionary technology that holds the key to expanding humanity's reach into the cosmos, setting the stage for missions to distant worlds like Mars. In this video, we'll take a closer look at Project Draco, its implications, not only for the future of space exploration, but also for the evolving landscape of the renewed space race and its relevance to national security. At the heart of Draco lies the aspiration to harness the potential of nuclear thermal propulsion, a cutting-edge technology that promises to redefine the way we navigate the cosmos. Unlike traditional chemical rockets, nuclear thermal propulsion employs nuclear reactions to heat a propellant, such as hydrogen, to extreme temperatures. The resulting high-speed exhaust propels the spacecraft forward, offering vastly superior efficiency and performance, potentially reducing the duration of space missions. Draco has been in the works for a while. DARPA initiated the program in 2021, and NASA joined in early 2023. Lockheed Martin and BWX Technologies have secured the contract worth $499 million for developing their in-space test spacecraft. Funding is evenly split, with DARPA and NASA each contributing half. NASA's involvement is logical, given its ongoing mission to send astronauts to Mars by the late 2030s or early 2040s. They see nuclear thermal propulsion as a crucial innovation that can significantly reduce travel time to and from Mars. In terms of the project's timeline, DARPA and NASA are targeting a late 2025 or early 2026 launch for the first in-space demonstration of Draco. The spacecraft to be developed for this mission will be positioned in a relatively high Earth orbit, likely ranging between 700 to 2,000 kilometers above the Earth's surface. This strategic altitude ensures that the Draco demonstrator will remain in orbit for years, allowing all of its nuclear fuel to be expended over time due to atmospheric drag. DARPA also reported that safety measures are paramount throughout the mission. Draco's nuclear engine will remain inactive until it reaches orbit, featuring a poison wire, a metal component that absorbs neutrons and prevents chain reactions, similar to control rods in nuclear power reactors on Earth. The spacecraft will operate in orbit for several months, with its primary task being the demonstration of the nuclear thermal propulsion engine's prolonged functionality in the space environment. The success of this operation relies on the challenging task of maintaining the hydrogen, approximately 2,000 kilograms of it, at super-cold temperatures throughout the mission. The spacecraft's design will revolve around the engine system and a sizable tank for hydrogen storage, making it compact enough to fit within the fairing of a standard launcher, such as SpaceX's Falcon 9. The renewed global interest in space exploration has given rise to a new space race, with nations and private entities vying for supremacy. Draco's advanced propulsion technology has the ability to place the U.S. in a strategic position, potentially leapfrogging competitors. This innovation could secure American leadership in future lunar and Martian missions. Beyond exploration, Draco has implications for national security and defense too. The capability to deploy nuclear thermal propulsion provides rapid response capabilities, safeguarding critical military satellite networks, and responding swiftly to emerging threats in space, a domain increasingly critical to national interests. As the Draco project accelerates towards its launch, it represents a beacon of innovation and possibility in space exploration. With the combined expertise of DARPA, NASA, Lockheed Martin, and BWX Technologies, this project is set to reshape space travel and ensure the U.S. remains a leader in space security too. What do you think? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content.